It's not uncommon to hear a modern-day city referred to as a concrete jungle. After all, concrete is used in everything from sidewalks to bridges and from buildings to dams. In fact, according to industry estimates, about 4.5 billion metric tons of concrete is produced globally each year. It's the most consumed man-made product in the world. It's strong, but it's about to get stronger. Thanks to the vision of Mark Massadi, a 39-year-old engineer who recently moved his biotech company, Alter Biota, to Cape Breton. He did so to take advantage of the unique opportunities available at the Verschuren Center for Sustainability and Energy in the Environment, a research and development institute located on the campus of Cape Breton University. The Verschuren Center offered a unique uh, opportunity for us to access a lot of the equipment that we couldn't otherwise access. Uh, and technical resources that uh, are allowing us to uh, scale our product and get it ready for the marketplace. Born into a construction industry family in Sudbury, Ontario, Masadi mixed his first batch of concrete by hand at the age of 12. He's still working with concrete, but now most of the work is done in the lab, where he and his team of highly skilled scientists are developing an additive that will make the product we all take for granted stronger and less expensive. In lay terms, it involves extracting biographene from biomass, which is generally plant and wood material, that is then used in small amounts as an additive in the concrete making process. The result is a stronger concrete produced at less cost, both financially and environmentally speaking, as it reduces the amount of Portland cement, which is one of the most carbon dioxide intensive materials in the world. And according to Masadi, there's no place better than the Verschuren Center when it comes to taking a product from the research stage to its commercialization. Alter Biata already has investors and industry partners awaiting the final product. In the meantime, Masadi and his team will continue to perfect the process that he hopes will someday save money and help the environment. For the Saltwire Network, I'm David Jalla in Sydney.